Right, so today I wanted to talk about what you're meant to do when somebody asks you, Miss, are you cold? I mean, what are you meant to say? For example, I was walking down the street only yesterday. I was wearing shorts and a t-shirt and it just so happened that I was inappropriately dressed for the weather. I hadn't checked the weather before I left the house and you know, it happens. So then this guy comes along and he's like, excuse me miss, are you cold? I'm like, what are you supposed to say in this situation? So I'm thinking, I could say yes, yes, I am cold. I dressed inappropriately, I'm sorry. But then what if he says, well, would you like my coat? No, I don't even know you. Or then he could say, oh, well, why don't we go get a coffee? Nope, but you don't want to be rude. And then it could get worse. It could get, oh, so you want my coat? You want my coffee? Do you want to come back to my house? Do you want to have sex with me? But then we have to assess the risks of what might happen if you say, no, no, I'm not cold. Don't even worry about it. Okay, so. If you took the no option, what are the consequences? One, he could think, oh, so she's probably developed this supernatural ability not to be cold from being a streetwalker or a whore or just generally dressing inappropriately at all times. So that's not an option. Or if you say no, it's like, oh, you know, you just seem like a freak. And especially, I am cold. And now that you've stopped me to ask me if I'm cold, then I'm gonna have to stand there shivering. And so really the only answer is yes, but then obviously there's the option you could just say, mm, perhaps. But with that level of ambiguity, you have no idea what you're getting yourself into whatsoever. So what do you do? Well, I hypothesize that you check the fucking weather before you leave the house. That's me. Thank you.